Wait, do you know this person? You know this person? Do you know this person? Yeah. You're in trouble. Someone's lying. <sighs> she might not show up for all we know. I mean, I've waited up maybe an hour before. Recently, it's gotten to where, you know, if it doesn't happen within 10, 15 minutes, I'm, I just kind of gone back home. Right there, here comes a car. I think this is it, guys. Mike, do you know her? Yeah. <clears throat> her name is Heather. We had a uh, another run-in on Plenty of Fish where she was somebody else and uh, called her out on it. She confessed, came clean, and then, uh, okay. Hi. Hi. Neve. I'm Heather. Okay, hi, Heather. Nice to meet you. Hi. I'm sorry. I'm very, I'm very sorry. I don't know what else to say. Why? I don't know where to start. Um, remember Claire? Yep. When my friend and I made the fake profile and we pretended to be Claire to see if her husband was cheating on her, I was just talking to people and you sent me a message. You just started talking to me and I thought you were cool as crap. And so I gave you my number, my real number. I sent you a picture and I was like, hey, my name is Heather. This is what we're really doing. And you are not very nice. <laughs> you didn't want to be my friend. And so I got upset. So I went and made Caroline. I originally did it just to be mean because I was mad at you. And then we have a lot in common. <laughs> we like the same stuff. We do the same things, we have the same personality. And I didn't, I didn't mean to fall in love with you. I didn't mean to start caring about you. It just happened. But why keep up the lie for so long? I tried not to, I tried to leave. Then after about a month, I missed you. How do you get rid of somebody who's an intricate part of your life? Who you tell all of your stuff to? What do I actually know to be true? Yeah, I made a big picture and it's not what I look like. Everything else I told you is me. Do you have cancer? No, I'm not sick. When I said that I was sick, I was at the point where I could tell that you were frustrated and you were gonna leave. I didn't know what else to do. I don't want to not have Michael in my life, no matter how I can have you. Other than being sick and being a teacher and what I look like in my name is real. I just don't know why it took so long for this to happen. Because I was scared. I can't even tell you how many times I walked into your work and turned around and walked back out. I will do whatever I have to do to make it up to you. Do you know this person? Is that who we're looking for? I can't for? see. Hold on. Did we stab? Is that him? That's dumb. Oh boy. I don't know if that's who we're looking for, but I don't know why Dama would be is out there. Is that here. her? She's now looking in our direction. Let's find out what the story is. Um, Hello. What's going on? Before you get upset or anything, you know, 
I just want to tell you, Charles isn't real. I'm Charles. I had a crush on you for like almost two years now. Um, <clears throat> I really like you. I could say I love you. I do love you. But no, I don't want to be crazy or anything. Why did you keep it going so long? Because I was scared. I felt more comfortable being portraying this guy that I know you like, is know is your type, and you reply back to him. And, you know, it That's just. Some um, I'm telling you now to get it off my chest. I want to see if we can move on to be more than friends. I just want to clarify. In the very beginning, you made the profile. You found photos of Jaleel. Do you know who, that guy? I, or I don't know. Just a random guy. Yeah. Okay. So you made the Polina Fish account. You searched. You what? You found her profile yeah. and you and messaged. I searched, yeah. Okay, got it. And who who does know about this? Does anybody else know about uh, this? The only person I let know was Chad because right. he was like, "I just need you to do this favor for me." He was like, "I got you, sis." I had to make at least one call to make it seem like he was a person. Right. When you first made the Plenty Fish account, what was the plan? Did I you have? I was just like, you know, trying to get a better, more intimate feeling with her, like get closer, like more than a friend, like type of way, you know. Did you ever try to come clean, or did you have a plan on how that was going to go? I thought about it, but then, like, I would always just get too scared to just be like, it's not what you think, and then I'll just never do it. It's like, I don't know, I was just scared. You're my best friend. I don't want to lose you as a friend, but I felt like if I can get Charles to make you some type of way, then I can definitely make you feel some type of way, too. This is like t too much. You shouldn't have did it this way. You came about it all wrong. I don't want to talk no more. Give us a second. My best friend betrayed me. She obviously cares about you a lot, has f lots of feelings for you, some as a friend, and uh, obviously more than that as well. So. She screwed up. I don't know why she thought she had to do this for this long. Exactly, for this long. That's why I'm really mad, because you took it so far. Definitely not the best way to go about this. I wasn't trying to intend to hurt her or do anything bad to her. She deserves somebody that'll treat her right, because all these guys that she messes with, they do nothing for her. I mean, when she's texting this guy all day, every day. She doesn't realize that she presses send and your phone buzzes? I usually have it on Do Not Disturb or something. I don't let it be loud. Do you guys sleep in different rooms? We sleep in the same bed. You sleep in the same bed? Yeah, we have a queen size bed. Hey, Max, we're just parking now. If you guys want to come outside, that works. All right. All right. Can't back out now. Here we go. Here we go. OK, are you ready Let's to do, do this? It. No, <sighs> that's my husband. Wow. That's Jamie. You okay? I don't know how to heal. I don't know what to say. I don't. I just want to know why. I just thought I knew there was something going on, and I couldn't figure out what was wrong. I did it to see if all the issues we were having was you just didn't want to be with me. I thought you, it was me you didn't you want. You thought that I would start talking to this guy as more than a friend? Why would you think I would do that? We've been married for seven years. I've never done that to you. Why would I do that now? <clears throat> I just didn't know what was wrong, and I could feel there was something wrong. What would you have done if I did, if I fed into that? I don't know. My thought process was panic. I'm losing you. I get insecure. You know, I get worried, but I don't pretend to be somebody else and try to trick you. I was stupid in the beginning. I didn't mean to hurt you or do any of that through it. I felt 
like I betrayed you by even doing that. The only reason this kept going was because I felt like that was what you needed. You kept telling Titus everything that was wrong, stuff that I didn't even know about. Like with your mom, I didn't understand how you felt towards your mom. And some things you never told me, but you told Titus. So the more I kept being Titus, the more I felt like I was helping you, learning how and what you were looking for. It would be nice if we could have those kind of conversations in real life. I know, and that's what I realized, that I was never able to do that and never took the time to understand why you felt those ways. I understand now. This is like the most you've ever said to me. It feels good to know that that connection was really you. And in a sense, it's kind of a relief. Now I don't have to tell you about Titus because the most nervous thing I was freaking out about was telling you. I'm a little upset that you started it the way you did, but if you could be like supportive like you are through messages, I wouldn't need to seek out the closest thing that I can talk to. I don't want to talk to Titus. I want to talk to you. Is this a relief for you, or is it more complicated now? It, it is a relief because the biggest thing I was concerned with was that he wouldn't believe me when I tried to tell him I didn't cross a line with Titus. And I hope you see now that I, w I wouldn't. It seems to be that part of why this kind of worked was that as Titus, like, he could read your message, he could process it, it's a one step removed, and it gives you time to breathe and think and consider what consider you're saying. What you're saying. Like, you would say something, you know, at, at first I didn't know what to say, but I could sit there and look and be like, okay, each piece I could break down and, you know, try to give an answer to each part of it. Maybe you, in a weird way, you keep the phone number, <laughs> and it, that's your, like, lifeline. lifeline. There could be some ways that you guys can figure out how to make this work. Right. This is a really good place to kind of take things and, and, and run with them. I feel like you should just go home. <laughs> Be at home now together for the first time in months without this thing Imagine between elephant you. Elephant in the room. Yeah, exactly. <sighs> Thanks. Yeah, so you guys go chill out, and then tomorrow we can check in with you guys. Sounds good. Does that work? Yeah. All right, guys. <laughs> we'll talk to you later, OK? Hey. <sighs> I'm sorry, babe. Well, I know what I have to do now when we have an issue in our bromance. Yeah. Just start pretending like I'm some girl on the internet. That's the best way to get to my heart. <laughs> what? This is Carrie. Oh, my f God. So, are you <laughs> serious? Wait, wait, wait. Really, Tars? And I didn't know it was you. You know this guy? Man, yeah. this is crazy. How do you know this guy? We dated like 10, 11 years ago. What? This is crazy. This ain't right. That's what it is. It's not right. You catfish me. Well, you catfish yeah, him too. Yeah, but still though. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So you had a fake profile. Yes. And messaged her fake profile. And it just so happened that you guys actually used to date? Man, that was a long time ago. It was so ago. long ago. Are you serious, man? Oh, my God. Wait, wait, time out. You used to live in St. Louis. I used to live with my mother in St. Louis. OK. I mean, this is a first. I'm like, oh, my This is crazy. This was you the whole you guys, time? This is destiny. No, uh -uh. no. It was a How long bad, were you guys bad did relationship. It? Oh, it was bad relationship. Yes, yes it, was it was really bad. While we were together, he had three kids on me. You told me you don't even have any kids. You have a lot of kids. How many kids do you have? They have four. He had all those kids on me. Really? Yes. He was just a H-O-E. That's all he was. Tally-ho. 
Tally ho. There you go. How did you make the tally profile? It wasn't originally me. It was one of my friends. He made the profile. Do I know your friend? Danielle or? or... Danielle. I, I'd rather not say his name. Wait, how did the profile start? I had a buddy who was using the profile to get females off of it. Why was he using Tally's picture? That's something I don't know. And I asked him about it. He was like, man, look, it's just getting me females. So you I'm like, know. OK, cool. But you don't know Tally? No, nah, I don't really know. How long have you been using the account? About a year and a half. And who was using it before you? Yeah, one of my friends was using it. So it's just like a community thing that you just pass on? I just don't on. understand. Why are you guys like using this profile? Why don't you just make a new one? I mean, because this one works. So what, what do you get out of this? Definitely didn't get what I wanted. Like, I need a break. There you go. I'm going to show This is crazy, man. So you've already had a relationship with her? Yes. It was... You don't want to revisit that? No. <laughs> no. What happened with this guy? <laughs> he asked me really bad. I was going to marry him with everything. He's <laughs> to be so bad. And you dated Shaquille four and a half years, man. But if I knew it was her, I was like, nah, no way. <sighs> God, man. I actually love Shaquille. But I'd mess things up. It got to the point where I just had to walk away. This is his life. This is all the females that he's cheated with me or he met them online. I met them online. You hear it kind of crazy. It got to the point where she started bleaching clothes. Bleaching clothes? Yes. Like, taking a knife, ripping up my shoes and stuff. It's like, man, and she pretended like she didn't want me to go, but I'm like, man, I can't do this. And so that's how I'm like, females at my house and everything. It's just like. It wasn't just me. I mean, there's times I came home and Shaquille was in the bed with another dude drunk. I mean, yes, we did each other, but man, this is kind of crazy. <laughs> so you were really in love with this guy. And what did you like about Carrie? Carrie was more caring. She'll talk to you. It ain't no lies or whatever. It felt like it wasn't no lies. You know, I told her things that I wouldn't even tell nobody else. I'm gonna go out there. Stay in here as long as you need. <sighs> Come on out when you're ready. This is kinda scary. So that's it. Those were our three addresses. No more addresses? That was it. Well, let's get back in the car. All right. It's cold. Let's go. But I don't want to get back in a car. Because oh, I'm going to find some. I mean, we're, we're trying we everything we can. Tawan, the reason why you stupid idiot can never find who Tony is because I'm Tony. What's up? What's going on? Why the would you do that? Because. Bring my you shouldn't, have, cause that ain't you cool. shouldn't never that call me a fat ass Kelly Price. Are you get mad out for that little bitty bull though. That's fed up. It's life. Deal with it. It ain't no fing Tony. Where's that? Oh well. For real, three years? I'm thinking it's Tony. You ain't no, no fing Tony. It's life. You have to deal with it. That ain't no my life. Is. That's bull. That's not bull. It's over. Don't talk to me ever no more, and I mean that. It was the right thing to do. Can you please go follow me with that damn camera? Yeah, I want a lot of space. Like, please. like 10 times more space. I don't even feel like talking about this boy. Don't play me like that. Now I'm going around over three people in my houses thinking I'm about to see a Tony. I just want to go home. I'm going home, I'm changing my number, earning my thing, and I mean that. So this is what, payback? Yes, paybacks, Payback. For what, for what? Paybacks, it's so funny, it's so funny to me. Because he, he talked about me in front of like everybody. So I was waiting for the right moment and that was the right moment. Well, I think I share your confusion, disappointment, and disgust. 
Here, you want to get in the car? Hell yeah, I want to get in the car and take the cameras off of me. Go ahead, go ahead. I want to go home. You can sit in the front. I'm, I'm sorry. What voice are you using to talk to him? The Tony voice. He never actually talked to Tony on the chat line, but he felt like he did because I called him like, you met me off the chat line. Because he always on there and he give his number out. So I started talking to him. So he never talked to anyone named Tony on the chat line? No. I've been talking to him for three That's years. Long... And I've been with him three years. Talk to him, be with him, talk to him, be with him. Instead of everybody that we know, now the world can see you like this. It's one step. Well, what did he say? Up. How did it start? It's one notch up. That I was a fat, hungry Kelly Price. Every little thing that humiliates somebody, he has said to me. The best way I knew how to get him back is I know that he'd be on the chat line. The joke was always on me. <laughs> so now the joke is on him. You kind of you you used us and kind of wasted our time to to get so to get back at your cousin for saying something about you three years ago? Yeah. Uh, it's lame. It's that's like, just lame. That's not lame. Actually, it's, it's lame. Good. No, it's lame. I catfish every single person. Oh. What? We got someone on a bike. Definite that's suspect. I'm feeling this biker. Wait, that looks like the guy in the pictures. Kind of does, right? Oh wait, he's dismounted. Oh. That does look like the guy from the picture. Do you know this person? You know this person? Do you know this person? Yeah. You're in trouble. Someone's lying. It's your ex-husband. No way. Is it really? Your ex-husband. So you were lying to us. You did catfish us. Hey, I'm Neve. Why don't you just tell what's us going what's going on? Did you know it was her? Oh, not until I got like to right by this tree right no. here. I didn't. I thought like this was gonna be a first time meeting. I, that's why I'm. I'm I I wonder, like, what's going Wait, what? But like, didn't she her. tell? You her name uh, via the texts, didn't she say, "Oh, my name is Shawnee"? I yeah. said my name is Shawnee. Yeah, right. This is not Shawnee. I don't understand. No, What's like, your name? Not a Shawnee. Ebony. Your name is not Shawnee. No. Why wouldn't you tell us that? Because I thought that you guys want to help me. Help you do what? To try to get my family back together. You did catfish us. You were right. I was right. Kind of. What the hell's going on here? Well, it all started when I got a new phone and I called Brandon. Is that your actual name? Yeah. He didn't answer the phone, but he texted back later that night trying to see who I was. He told me his name was Jack. Why didn't you just say your name? I don't know who it was. Okay, <laughs> I right. might just give okay. anybody my real name. No, I didn't tell him who I was. I just want to get this straight. So you got a new phone. Yeah. Called Brandon. You didn't answer. No. You then texted, who is this? That's how this all started. Yeah. We weren't talking at the time. We were in the process of separating then. Wait, so hold on. And what did you everything. think for five months when you couldn't get this girl on the phone? She said she, she was doing music, so I figured, like, maybe... And she talked about traveling a lot, so I figured... You, Shawnee, was doing music and traveling a lot. You took every chapter out of the catfish book. Catfish well, he stuff. catfished me, and I catfished him When back. did he catfish you? Because he told me his name was Jack. That's because you're some stranger hitting him up while, you know... Yeah. Time out. Ebony, you did all this stuff. Yeah. You lied to us. You lied to Brandon. You lied and cheated your way here. For what? 
I felt like I didn't know what else to do. Honestly, we were living in the same house and we weren't even talking to one another. And the kids would see that all the time. And I just thought like maybe he could talk to me as a different person. How is it that you can just maintain for five months being like the perfect person ever just about, and like for 16 years, you couldn't even get it together. Like, why can't we do that as Brandon and Ebony? I don't want to have to be somebody else to be loved.